This is Brian with ScreenFiles.com and Trailer to Reaction. A few hours ago, the full trailer for James Bond's No Time to Die dropped. And we're going to take a look at that. Though I have to ask the question because it bugs me, frankly. No Time to Die? What does that mean? That literally has meaning. Now, it would be referring to the fact that the 007s are always needed and that James Bond being that this is likely Daniel Craig's last Bond movie, that that can't go away? Is it a reference to that? Or does it have something to do with the fact that... Actually, I don't know what else <laughs> it could have to do with, to be totally honest. In any case, let's take a look at a trailer for No Time to Die. Why would I betray you? We all have our secrets. You just didn't get to yours yet. The world is arming faster than we can respond. Where's Dr. No I need a favor. You're the only one I trust for this. It looks lighter. The world's moved on, Commander Bond. You were double O. Two years. So stay in your lane. You get in my way. I will put a bullet in your knee. The one that works. I thought you two would get along. Uh oh. No. Some people Bond. can go shit crazy over this woman. James Bond. So you're not dead. Hello, Q. I've missed you. It's the most valuable asset this country has. If you feel yourself losing control, I'm not going to lose control. James, you gave up everything for her. When her secret finds its way out, it'll be the death of you. What is it? I don't know what this is. James Bond. License to kill. History of violence. I could be speaking to my own reflection. Only your skills die with your body. Mine will survive long after I'm gone. History isn't kind to men who play God. Rami Malek. Oh, nice job. Well, that was the trailer for No Time to Die, and it does feel like a swan song. And as I said in my review of the teaser trailer, I'm okay with that. I think this interpretation, this version of James Bond needs to go. And that's not to say that it's bad or run its course, more so than the times are changing, and it's it doesn't really fit anymore. We need a bond that is more contemporary, a bond that is more... I want to say human, but Daniel Craig's interpretation is actually very human, but it's also very cold and distant. So, I don't know, maybe we need Piers Brosnan back, <laughs> which is interesting. This is Brian with ScreenFiles.com and Braylon to React. Have a good day, and don't forget, if you like this video, please consider a like and subscribe.